Hello, miners, Munchmo back with more modded Minecraft from the Xenocraft server. Um, what's going on? Let's see. I actually did a live stream, after all, on Friday. Um, wasn't my normal live stream, and I'm not planning on doing it on Fridays anymore, but I just happened to have already kind of had myself in a way that I could, so I did it anyway while waiting for some stuff, and then, yeah. Anyway, so what I've done here, let's see, the changes I've made. I set up this system here with blazes... Angry Zombies, and, um, the Wither Skeletons. Nope. To, uh, allow me to control having a certain amount of stuff in there. Um, killed by this thing here. Oh, yeah, that's just that thing. The, uh, Mob Grinder. Wait, why is... Oh, it's like, in the essence is pumped out over here. To a place where I can go drink it if I need XP. Blah, it's really horrible. Not sure. Do I have, um... There's a chest somewhere. I have a... Oh, there it is, under the stairs there. I may have, uh... Yeah, um... I can hook you up if you want. Yeah, okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. Put that there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I wanna do this. Hold on, hold on. I wanna put one of these here. One of these here, and let's see if this works. So, two zombie spawners. Um, two zombie spawners. Unless you want more. So there's that. So if I take another one of these here, and I go boop like that. Here, how about how about how about three? About three. Um, so, anyway, what was I saying? Um, I don't know. I got this system set up so that I automatically output all of my excess materials, which is iron, swords, tools, armor, gold armor, and, um, chain armor here to turn this into crap for me. <laughs> um, so anytime the, the spawner down there is active and the excess crap goes in there, it gets kicked out here and turned into actually block of gold, block of steel. So let's see how bad I am. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Let's do this. Everything except you. on just me. Okay. I don't know if that makes a difference. I might be able to do something about that. I don't know. Let's see. Block of... What? How about gold? Wait a second. Iron? What? Something ain't right here. Because I should have... All sorts of stuff. Oh, they're, they go in here. My bad. Look at all. Look at all that. Wow, I had a lot of stuff. Um. So yeah, I got, I got all this box of stuff. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Do 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 do. Um, meet me at spawn. Come on, man. You can do it. I got something to give to you. Is this spawn? Nope, that's the end. That is spawn. And it's nighttime. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. Come on, dude. I'm right here. My hop. My king. I got. Oh. Let's see here. Is there a Munchmo, Zuria's, Entry Island, Angus Treehouse, Centinium? Oh, well. I guess I'll just head back down here. Oh, this is the wrong place. I always do that. Oh, okay. Anyway. Um, I honestly don't know exactly what to do this episode. So I'm just going to do what I'm going to do. Um, I am cleared out space for bees. I've got carpenters and stuff going for making bee machines. I've actually got some bee machines in the works. So that's a good thing, right? The bioreactor in the most recent update, I th or the most recent update we're running, I think we're 114, and there's actually been updated like 117. I haven't bothered updating the server yet. Okay, I need to slow down my speech. Sorry. I'm a little overly excited. Um, but anyway, the bioreactor's rate of return is super slow. I'm feeding it crap all the time, and it's... Where in the heck am I going? It's like, uh, it should be right over here somewhere. Yeah, almost there. There it is. But yeah, um, the rate at which it's delivering me the goodies is so slow. 
I'll show you. I mean, it's like it. Even though I'm putting like I think I'm putting three things in there right now. I'm not really sure. I need some dirt too to finish the area for the bees I've been working on. Um, all right, let's put these back since he doesn't seem to want them. Well, I got extra zombie spawners. I wouldn't mind getting a skeleton spawner because that guy doesn't give me arrows. But as you can see, I'm not even carrying a bow. Um, you know what? Here's a thing. I need dirt. There we go. Okay, so let's head on over to where I've been working recently. As you guys may remember from the last episode. It's, oh, I forgot about this. I ran out of power in my jetpack, so I had to uh, pillar up. It was horrible. So horrible. There we go. Still working over here. And see, look look at this. This thing is still... Gee, it's so slow. And I got an essence berry bush I threw back here. I don't... Oops. You don't, I don't want light back here. So I only have the one. I borrowed it from somebody. I'll return it if they want it back. But I don't remember who I took it from. I think it was Captain. I'm not exactly sure. And he hasn't been active lately. So if he wants it back, he can have it back. But uh, So yeah. Here is where I'm planning on doing my beekeeping stuff. So you can see, I have a few machines going. Um, let's throw some more light in here on the subject. Okay. Got a couple machines going. Not a whole lot. Um, oh, let's see. Rainfall, I, already, I think I already have uh, yeah, rainfall. Okay. Problem is, I can't just take this and go bleh and get rid of it. I have to actually, like, throw it. Um... I'll show you how I have this system set up, actually. It's pretty cool. Um, it's not super-duper awesome. Cultivated, I've already got. No humid. Down one humid. Is that something I have or not? Let's see. Down. Both one temp. Both one humid. I don't think I want just down one humid. Because if I got both one humid, I'm fine. Tropical. Hooray. Um, slowest flowering. I would like to get my hands on the poisonous effect. But okay, so here's my system so far. I've got the power coming in from that right there, which also feeds power to this, which is my uh, wheat farm. Right now I only have two machines, but I will be putting in more probably this episode. Woohoo! Um, this is my thing that takes the bees and gives me the serums. Throw a serum in here, it goes down into the same tesseract that feeds back into my system, which automatically outputs all serum vials oops, boop, into um, a, a, a furnace, which cooks them, turns them back into regular serum vials, and then delivers them, exports empty serum vials here through a tesseract. This is a tesseract right there into this chest, which I can then go put this back in here, and the cycle continues. See, I just go, okay, I don't want that one, and I just throw it, and then eventually it'll come back up here cooked. Huh? And so if I tell the machine to make me more serum vials, it will automatically do that, and I will have more available, and yada, yada, yada. This is my bee melting machine, which right now it's just kind of melting. It automatically sends it back through a liquid tesseract here into my BNA tank, which is this thing right here. ta -da! Which is almost full. Which is why I need to get the rest of these machines set up and going, right? Yeah, let's do that now. Um, oh well, before I do that, let me just go on above this. This is the area where I'm going to actually have, like, alvearies and the flowers and even some trees. I'm probably going to set up another one of these, um, these multi-farms for orchard, the unmanaged orchard that collects the nuts and stuff, because I need nuts for seed oil. But, uh, that won't be this episode. First thing I want to do is just get all my bee machines up and going. I think I've got pretty much everything I need to make that happen. Cross your fingers. So the first thing I need is an isolator. Wait, I already have the isolator. I need an inoculator. Oh, there's two. Only one N in inoculator. I always do that. Do I have what it takes to make an inoculator? I do not. Do I have what it takes to make magma creams? Do I have what it takes to make blaze powder? I do. Oh, geez, I have a lot of blaze powder. Boop. That'll do. Two, three, four. I don't have any slime balls. Oh, wrong thing. Crap. Do I have any? No, I don't. Okay. Well, let's look at the next one then. Inoculator. What's next? Um, purifier. I can make a purifier, right? 
One of these. Okay, hold, let me make sure I don't have these things already. Okay. That's fine. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo. Okay. Good fire. Dang. Did I just make two tanks? Or did I make three tanks and I needed four? I don't even know. Okay. Purifier. Easy peasy. Now I need the... The next thing. It's called a... Crap, what's it called? It's called it's called a synthesizer. Synth? Not synthin. Synthesizer, that thing. Oh, I need more tanks. I need more glass. Boop, make me more glass while I'm waiting, please. I always need more glass. Okay. So I have the purifier. I have the synthesizer. I have the inoculator. I have the gene pool. I don't have the inoculator. While we're waiting on that to do stuff, let's see if we can't hunt some magma cream. Magma, magma bitches, whatever they're called. The magma guys, you know, the guys that are all squish squash, squish squash in the nether. Maybe we'll find some, maybe we won't. Instead, I'll probably suffer horrendous lag. Do you see them anywhere? I see spiders. I see a ghast. Can I see through the world, please? Or not see through the world. I want magma cream. Looking for magma, magma mags, whatever they're called. Oh, oh I don't like that sound at all. Are there any of you guys anywhere around here? I see spiders everywhere. That's not pleasant. I see lots of bats, too. Those are definitely not pleasant. But I'm not seeing any magma mags. Why is this thing not working? Did I do something wrong here? I think I did something wrong here. And these spiders are all going to kill me, aren't they? Ah, don't set me on fire. Laggy lagger, McLagger. Ah, they set me on fire. Luckily, the fire doesn't really do a whole lot to me, it seems. Okay, let's try this again now. You. Send only public access, never lo nether lava pump. Okay, you. Receive only energy. So this thing should be going. Oh, I bet you I need a pipe between them. That's probably what it is. Or maybe it's active and I just don't know it. Oh, bats. Gasts and creepers and spiders, but no magma squishes. That's what I really want is magma squishes. Oh, did you see that? It looked like it went through the wall. <sighs> okay. No worries. Hopefully I've got enough glass by now. I know sometimes I have some, um, whatchamacallits down in there. What are they called? S slimes. So eventually I'll get this stuff. I just go without this thing for the time being. Okay. There we go. That's a good amount of glass. Let's see. Let's make a few tanks. Is There we go. Okay, so I need a synthesizer. Good. Now I just need the inoculator, which I can't do. Because I'm missing two slime balls. Two? Maybe Josh won't mind if I... No, I'm not going to take borrow from Josh. Nope, 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 nope. I gotta find a way to get slimes more reliably because that's like one of the things that's... Oh, I can make slime balls now. That's right. I can make them. So let's put these things down and then I'll make slime balls. Okay. So here we've got the purifier and the synthesizer. These two go doink and doink. So these things are ready to go. Powering up. Good. Don't have any fuel. That's okay. And then the last one goes here. I can't believe I totally forgot about the fact that I can make slime balls because I have the bees that make the pollen. So here we go. Um, okay, let's see. I need the inoculator. I need this. I need that. That's what I want. Two of those. Perfect. Got it. Good. We got this. We got this. We got this, and then that, and then I just need those two things there. So I'll go with those, um, and we'll be good to go. And I need to bring some bees down there to melt. And oh, you know what I can do? I can, real quick, I'm going to go out here. Um, 
go out here, grab my chest of bees, because I have a huge chest of bees. It's kind of crazy, actually, how many chests, how many bees I've got down here. These are all for melting. Boop. Thank you. This thing is just going to get slapped right there on top of that other thing and just start melting them all. Because that's what these are for. And it's just perfect. I can probably turn off those um, bees over there for the time being, maybe. Uh, hopefully soon. I'll, oh, you know, I need to get a tank in for seed oil. But i got to get my seed oil set up. I think that's what we'll... Oops. That's what we'll do next is... Uh, oh, wait. i got to go this way. I'm a little scatterbrained. I'm hungry, very hungry. I've eaten some stuff, but it hasn't really satisfied me. So that's part of the reason, plus caffeine. It's part of the reason why I'm a little scatterbrained right now. And I'm really sorry about that. But, uh, okay, so you give me that. Do, 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 and you can go right there. And voila. Now the bee should start going in there and getting melted. I need two of those, perfect. And we will go ahead and throw that in there. I think I'm just going to go ahead and stick this bee in here for the time being to get melted. There. Okay. Oop, poison effect. That's exactly what I wanted, I think. Right. Poison effect. Freezing effect. Poison effect. I think that's all I needed from these bees now, right? Both one. Short. Both one. Tropical. Jungle. That's one that I needed. Slowest. Normal. Default territory, I think. Poison, flowers, tremble. Okay, and so we got default territory should be... Yeah, okay, cool. So now I can throw all these to be cooked. And then this can go in here to get melted. Good. All right. That'll work out pretty nicely. So let's get these things up there. Get our inoculator down here. And then we'll be good to go. Next episode, yeah, next episode, we'll, uh, I'll have stuff thrown together to get the tree farm going because I think Josh was nice enough to give me some walnut saplings. I really hope he was, at least. So here we go, and inoculator. Let's take a look and see. Walnut. Oh. No. What do we got? We got silver lime. How about we sort by name? Apple, alder. Beach, Force, Great Wood, Jungle, Oak, Pecan, which I got those before. Rubber, Silver Birch, Silver Lime, Spruce, Sweet Chestnut. That's what I'm looking for. Chestnuts. Oh, yeah. I think those are the good, good, good ones. So we'll, we'll grow those ourselves and then uh, see what I can do about getting more. Actually, I might as well just do that now. Ba -dum -ba -ba. Actually, no, I'll wait. I shall wait. But we have the last step in our approach here of the inoculator. And voila. See? Here we go. So this thing's melting. These things are filling up with stuff, slowly but surely. And we can start making our serums work. Thank you so much to Renly, everybody. You should say thank you to Renly, too, for supplying me with the bees that I need to make this happen, which is he gave me the Imperial and the Industrious Bees. Um, so, yes, it is amazing that he was able to do that for me because he worked so hard over the weekend, and I had been having so much trouble getting them to happen. And now with those, I can start making everything I need to really get my bee production off the ground and make a good bee exhibit for my museum. But... Unfortunately, that is um, not all we've got today. I will go ahead and plant these trees if I can get them to grow. I'll get a stack of these. Get that. Okay. We'll see if we can get these to grow down there. I don't know if there's going to be enough space because these are really big trees. I might have to clear out more room or something. Chop it down. Get more saplings, hopefully. We'll see. We will see what happens here. I mean, it is pretty tall room, but these are really tall trees, so. And I'm afraid that wouldn't work. Yep. Luckily, boop, boop, right in here, we got a lot of extra room. So if I go like this, I just grab some dirt from over here. I should hopefully be able to get them to grow here. Cut them down. Right? Please grow. Yes! And then I can go 
bush like that. Cut it down. Get me some saplings. Some more saplings. And then this will turn me into a nice um, farmer of walnuts. And that will get me the seed oil that I'll need for my... Man, that takes a lot of room. Holy crap. I'm going to have to expand the ceiling all the way up to like this level here, I think. Yeah, probably at least this level. Hopefully that'll be enough of a reminder for me to know that I have to increase the ceiling height. It should. So yeah, lots of saplings from this tree too, which is awesome because it's so big. Unlike that stupid jungle tree, which barely gives saplings at all. Look at this, it's already... I've got three of the four that I used to plant it. Oh, make that four. There we go. Oh yeah, I will have so many... This is great. But that is all that I have time for today, guys. I wish I could do more, but I have no idea what I would even do. So I've got to spend some time figuring out exactly what we're going to do next, uh, I think, and getting prepared for it. So thanks for joining me. I hope this has been enjoyable for you. And if it has, please remember to click that like button, show your support, and let me know that I am doing right by you. So thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.